you guys Aaron here and today I want to talk about PUBG New State new battle royale game coming out to iOS and Android sometime this year I want to give you guys my reaction to the trailer and some gameplay screenshots that we actually got and also throughout this trailer although it is mostly cinematic there's a little bit of gameplay sprinkled throughout so we have a pretty good idea of what this game is going to look like and I gotta say it does look amazing I'm gonna give you guys my thoughts on the game and also talk about how this game will affect COD Mobile because as you guys know the only mobile game I really play is COD Mobile, so give you guys my thoughts on how this game will affect COD Mobile too. So my thoughts on PUBG New State, it looks fantastic, like the graphics look great, animations look good, everything about it screams like console quality, graphics, and gameplay on mobile, which of course I think everyone wants that. I know if you have like a lower end device, maybe this probably won't run for you, I don't know exactly what the requirements will be, but still the game looks amazing. This is actually made by Crafton, not Tencent. So there's already PUBG Mobile in the apps from the Google Play Store, made by Tencent. But for this game, they're going with a different developer, Crafton, which I think is probably a good thing. I'm, I don't really play PUBG Mobile, but I play Cloud Mobile, of course, also made by Tencent. So I know Cloud Mobile Battery Out isn't in that great of a state right now, like a lot of bugs and that kind of thing. So people aren't really too happy about the Cloud Mobile Battery Out right now. So if you play PUBG Mobile, let me know in the comments below. What is the state of that game? Are people enjoying it still? What is that game like? Because again, I have no idea. So let me know in the comments. But you can see we've got actual in-game screenshots. You can see the HUD. Everything looks great. Graphics still look good. HUD looks fine. I think with mobile games, as long as, as long as there's like a lot of customization options for the HUD and your controls, everything will be all good there. So don't know when this game's coming out. They said 2021. You can, pre you can pre register right now on the Google Play Store. For iOS, they said pre-registration is coming at some point in the future. Don't know when exactly. There's probably going to be some sort of soft launch or beta period for the game also within the next like couple of months maybe, I don't know. The game does look great. The only real concern I have about this game is the device requirements and how well it will run on older devices. But other than that, I think the gameplay will be fine because obviously they have the blueprint for PUBG gameplay. It's already set up with the console and PC version and also they can take stuff from the PUBG mobile too. So they have the blueprint for the gameplay set up. The graphics look amazing, you can see that here. Just how well will it run on older devices is the real question because of course if you have like an iPad Pro it's going to run amazing. The latest like Galaxy device S21, S20, you'll be good but older iPads, older iPhones, older Samsung devices, how will it play? That's the real question. Of course there's going to be a lot of like graphical options you can choose from and lower the graphics and whatever, lower the frame rate even. So we'll see how it ends up bringing older devices. Again as long as there's a lot of customization with the settings here, everything should be good. Now the big question is how does this affect COD Mobile? A lot of people I've seen on social media and Reddit say, are saying that like COD Mobile's dead when this game comes out, this game's gonna take over. RIP, PUBG Mobile, COD Mobile, Grain or Free Fire. Pretty much every mobile game ever is gonna die when this game comes out. Obviously not. But for COD Mobile specifically, I don't know how PUBG Mobile is gonna fare. I feel like PUBG Mobile could be in trouble though. Unless like the only players they'll probably keep are the ones that are playing on lower end devices that can still run PUBG Mobile. Other than that, I feel like if this game ends up being better than PUBG Mobile, why would you want to play that game if you can play New State instead? So PUBG Mobile might be in trouble. But as for COD Mobile, COD Mobile's in like half trouble. And what I mean by that is that COD Mobile sells multiplayer. And really there's no competition from this game to their multiplayer mode. And multiplayer is probably the main like focus of COD Mobile. So I think COD Mobile still stick around. There's really no competition there for the multiplayer aspect of COD Mobile. Now, when it comes to the COD Mobile Battle Royale, COD Mobile Battle Royale might be in trouble unless there's like some sort of major update because really this game looks way better than COD Mobile Battle Royale. Like COD Mobile Battle Royale, I think the issue with the Battle Royale and COD Mobile and why I personally don't really play it and don't really like it that much is because it feels like it's just like PUBG Mobile, except they just put a Call of Duty skin on top of it. And I know it's the same developer, that's probably why it's like that, but the reason Warzone is so much fun is because it still feels like Call of Duty just with the Battle Royale game mode. Whereas COD Mobile Battle Royale is like PUBG Mobile with a COD Mobile skin on top of it. So it doesn't really feel like Call of Duty to me. That's where the issue with COD Mobile Battle Royale is for me at least. And if there's a better Battle Royale, Battle Royale game out there, like this PUBG New State could be, why would I want to play that when I could just switch to this game? So in conclusion, do I think COD Mobile will die? No, of course. 
the multiplayer mode will keep that game alive for forever, basically, because it's so popular. The Battle Royale mode, on the other hand, for Cloud Mobile could be in trouble. Again, this new state game, if it's if it plays as good as it looks, then people are definitely going to be switching over to PUBG New State. So we'll see what happens with the Battle Royale mode for Cloud Mobile. Again, overall, though, this game coming out is good for everyone. No matter what game you play, PUBG Mobile, Garena Free Fire, Cloud Mobile, any other Battle Royale game, Knives Out, whatever else you play. I don't know what else is out there. I guess Fortnite will probably still be the same because that's such a different game, but competition is always good. So when a new game like this comes out, it forces everyone else to step their game up. So we'll see how these other games respond because of course when PUBG New State does come out, there's going to be a huge player base for this game right away because people are really hyped about it. And of course those other games are going to have to find a way to retain their player base so people don't just completely abandon their game and switch over to PUBG New State. So we'll see how they respond. Of course these games are going to have to up their graphics, up their gameplay, everything like that. I think honestly for COD Mobile, a full reboot of their battery ammo mode might need to happen. And maybe honestly make it more like Warzone possibly, I don't know. Because like I said, COD Mobile battery Royale isn't in the best state right now. So we'll see what happens. Let me know in the comments below what do you guys think of this new PUBG New State gameplay trailer. Are you guys hyped for it? How do you think it will affect the other games that are currently out there right now like PUBG Mobile, COD Mobile, Free Fire, anything else? Thanks for watching. Peace.